resident Wendy Williams returned home from work on Tuesday afternoon to find this swarm of bees the size of a football making themselves a home in her backyard. I heard this buzzing. Uh, I was in the backyard and I couldn't figure out where the bee was. Oh, I thought it was just one, but it's like way too loud for that. And I came out to the yard and this is in my hazelnut tree. It was uh, much more open. There were, the bees were swarming around. Obviously, they had just arrived. And so, yeah, I just stood back and watched in awe. Williams was originally told the bees would probably move on by Tuesday night, but the rain kept them there until Wednesday morning when longtime beekeeper Rick Plantinger turned up to move the swarm along and explain the reason why the bees were there in the first place. This is their natural way of reproducing. So they split the hive basically. The mother queen, the original one, takes off with about a half of their bees or more and they look for a new home. And they usually hang, up, hang out about a half a mile or so from where they came from and then they send out scouts to look for new places when they decide where to go then they all head over there and set up a new house although not everybody would be too happy about having thousands of bees in their yard beekeeper kevin hamilton says from nature's perspective it's actually a good sign that a hive is healthy enough to grow to the point where they can expand forecasting using Kelowna, i'm laura brooks